The number one reason you've got to get a lawyer to get divorced is you don't know what you don't know. Now, here's a perfect example of a client I represented a while back, and she and her husband had thought they were going to get divorced without lawyers, right? Like, he is this fancy CFO. She'd been a stay-at-home mom. He had it all handled. Don't you worry about it, okay? And they came to me um, saying, hey, can you represent both of us? No, I cannot represent both of you. I'm a lawyer. I have fiduciary duties. I can only represent one of you. So I represented the wife, and we started looking at this deal that they'd made that was a really good deal for her. Now, look, I don't think this guy was trying to be a bad guy. He just didn't know what he didn't know. Because in this deal, it didn't have anything about his bonus. He hadn't received it yet, but he was entitled to it. So when he was entitled to it for work performed in a year while they were married, that made it community property. And it was going to be like six figures, mid six figures, right? It was a lot of money. And it wasn't even on the spreadsheet. 